Welcome back, everybody! If you haven't played Enlisted, the first-person combined arms World War II combat game published by Gaijin, then you may not have realized that they recently released a Pacific Theater campaign. That's right, in addition to the battles of Moscow, Berlin, Stalingrad, invasion of Normandy, and the Battle of Tunisia, they've added the Pacific War. And sure, you've got lots of cool things that you can unlock on the Japanese side of things. You've got a uh, float plane there, some sort of early machine gun, a tank, a sword of course, a moderately hilarious looking fighter plane here, the predecessor to the Zero, and a number of other things. I was really interested in the Pacific Theater for the Americans. Ultimately it's pretty uneventful until we get up to the 9th Marine Regiment with the Browning Automatic Rifle. I'm a big fan of the bar. We can also get a group with a 2-inch mortar. I've had a lot of fun playing with that particular crew. The M2A4 is always a good time. It's, it's definitely the fastest armored vehicle I have experienced in this game to date. But the real reason I was interested in this is the Dauntless. By golly. The SBD-3 Dauntless. The attention to detail on this modeling is just great, from the paint chipping due to the, uh, the salt water and the kind of difficulty keeping these things well maintained out on the carrier to the red dive brake. Ah, man, I cannot, I cannot wait to get to this thing. Now, unfortunately, it's level 16. I myself am at, uh, even after, I don't know, five, six hours of gameplay, I'm only just on to level 11 here. So... <laughs> I've still got to unlock, just to give you an idea how bad this is, I've got to get through the F2 Buffalo before I actually get over to the Dauntless. Plus, Gaijin was kind enough to send me one of their premium packs, so I've actually got an LVT as well. You may recall that I did a video on War Thunder where I paired the LVT with the Dauntless and talked about that being one of my favorite low-tier combinations. I'll actually be able to do that in Enlisted at some point. Unfortunately, even for we partnered content creators, there is no way for us just to unlock all of the equipment here. They even want us to grind, and I just don't have enough enlisted gold to be able to get there. Speaking of enlisted gold, many thanks to my patrons and YouTube channel members. Their support is really helpful. Here are just a few clips of my gameplay here on the Pacific Theater. Oh, we already got people there. These guys are hauling. We have an incredible team right here. Or we're playing against nothing but bots. Which, I mean, either way. There's some good verticality in this. Somebody be shooting at me, boss. Oh, dang it. I, th I really thought they'd be able to get right in the door there. Oh, yeah, that guy shot me. Gosh. 
<laughs> Oof. Thought thought I was gonna have him. And let alone. Let alone, uh, you know. Are we just too close? There you go. Alright, we'll go build it right here. And. But anyway, so I'm not super interested in making the shorts right now. And just, uh. Been super busy with real life stuff that's been. Not really giving me a whole lot of time to do as much content creation as I would like. But that's okay. That is why I love iron sights and a good bolt action rifle. If you can see them, you can hit them. Ooh. All right, let's go get another spawn point built over here. Ooh. Are you serious? <laughs> All right. Dang it. <laughs> uh, his was an honorable death. You imagine that letter to his, like, home to his sweetheart or something? He was, I mean, he fell in some shallow water, broke a leg, couldn't make it. <laughs> Yeah, we'll go. We'll get to the other side here, hopefully. Or we'll die on the way. Okay. Two inch mortar. 65 meters, huh? By golly. And... Keep sending them. Oh, we got somebody. Oh, we got it. We got... Wow. All right. All right, let's get in here. By golly. You guys, we'll see. <laughs> You think it'll work? We got to test it, right? Like, we got to test it. 30 meters. <laughs> well, I don't hear him hitting right above me. Ow. Oh. Hey, you know what? We didn't get killed. You know, with uh, Modern Warfare 2 coming out at some point soon, I'd been thinking about... <laughs> I'd been thinking about trying... Uh, trying uh, Battlefield 2042 again. It's like it's like the worst abusive relationship ever, you know? Just like, well... Maybe they've changed. <laughs> they haven't changed. I'm not going back there. Just give us Battlefield 4 again. You know, you know? <clears throat> get rid of some of the like weird blue, you know, stuff. The blue, white, flickery lights and stuff. Man, that would make me so happy. Which means they're not going to do it. This guy, this guy has got nine lives. It's ridiculous. There we got him. It's all right. Oh yeah, you guys keep shooting him. Shot all around that guy before we finally got him. Oh, wow. Good. All right. 
Okay. Okay. We can to protect the tank. We need the tank. It's got blasted in half by an anti-tank rifle. The guy, the guy missed the tank that was point blank in front of him and shot me in half from like 200 meters away. Ridiculous. Uh, you know what? Let's bring out our mortars here. Seems like they have got a lot of people who could stand to. Suffer a lot of painful death, you know? If I could get one of my guys bringing me some ammo here, that would be really helpful for us. There you go. We're <laughs> actually doing pretty well here. I found this this fall. It's uh, oh gosh, what is it? Early October, as I record this, and just time flies, you know. This whole year has gone fast, and and as you get older, like you start to feel like you know time is going faster, you know. It's just you seems like you you look back on it and you just blink and it's been you know a week or a month or you know suddenly it's your daughter's birthday again like wh where did the time go like what happened <laughs> you know you definitely experience that Ooh. lovely little morning mission for us here let me see if we had any bad guys out there See anything just yet? We don't want to fly in too predictable a manner, or we'll get sniped right out of here. Uh oh. Or because we're flying like the least aerodynamic airplane ever made, we'll just fall out of the sky. Because these things happen, you know? There you go. Oh, we got some sort of damage on something. Oh, and a rifle kill. I don't even... We got a Springfield... We got a Springfield kill on somebody. I don't even know how to... How to explain that. I'd love someone to spot something. Oh! I was gonna go shoot down that float plane, but then I saw this happening out here. What happened with that grenade? Dude, get down! Alright. Three rounds left? Dude, you gotta reload. They got, yeah, they got our truck first, but we eventually got them, by golly. I'm stuck. Let's, oh, there we go. All right. Doing what we can with what we lay down. Oh, man. Wow. All right, that guy. That guy's fine. Optic on that sniper rifle, probably less so. Oh boy, nearly, nearly shot our buddy right in the eyeball right there. Um, let's try bringing out the tank again. This thing is so fast, like this is totally unlike the other tank gameplay in this, in this game. This is great.
Let's see here. We'll have just the one guy hop out. Start getting some cap point benefit here, maybe. Will he? Yeah, yeah, he will. All right. <laughs> Tank is nice and protected here. Good. So you cover the cover the back end of your own tank right here. Let's get back in there. Okay. Yeah, how are we gonna move to get up here? I hear something. Oh, enemy duck boat. Love it. I'll take that those weak undershots for you here. At least a couple of them. Alright, how far are we? Man, just like another maybe two of those missions and we'll be almost there. <laughs> then a shotgun I don't care about. And then a plane that may at least have some maneuverability. The grand will be nice. Flamethrower. And then eventually, <laughs> just like... I, I don't even know. Eight more hours of grinding? Something like that? Looking forward to it. It's gonna be really exciting. You know, and I do, I am excited to get the M1 carbine, carbine, when we unlock this next group. That will be a, a nice addition to our repertoire of death. I am not envious of people who had to engage in trench warfare. Obviously, the whole point was that, you know, your trenches were on your side and their trenches were on their side, but still. I don't think we're going to quite be out of the way enough. Those B-25s? Is there a chance we get B-25s in here at some point? <laughs> Person holding his, uh... Holding his medical thing, like, yay! Oh, wow. Holding his medical crate. Rally point destroyed. Come on now. I like that rally point. That was a good rally point. If I had an engineer, I'd go build another one. Hey, thank you. Um, yep, we'll use this group to go and build another one. Engineers, the, the, the location of spawn points. And the spotting of enemies are what win battles in, in uh, this game. That was a living person's knee. Rude. It's just so obviously the War Thunder camouflage. Do you see that? <laughs> what happened? Oh no. Can we back out? Can we get out of this? Well, that, uh, that did not go well. Of course, they actually do have a tank in here. Wow, this this tank commander with the grease gun has got 90 rounds of ammo. He's better armed than most of my infantry. Gun that packs a punch, too.
You guys getting out to heal? You should totally get out and heal. We're just, we're gonna hide. We're gonna hide real quiet like. It's gonna be great. Oh wow, okay, that guy ran right past me, didn't see me, good. That grenade's gonna be a problem. Yep. <laughs> like, ah, well, not a lot we can do about that, so we'll just, we'll embrace it. Well, our rally point is doing a lot of good, uh, okay, a lot of good things for the team right now, which is great, except we can't all spawn in one rally point. We need another rally point also. I can only build one, so... You see the problem. Hi there. Lovely to see you. Shot at, I just don't know from where. I mean, it sounds like it's close. Pick off all your people. The rally point got destroyed. No. <laughs> Building a spawn point right here. Totally just mess with them. We're spawning back with you guys. I hear their vehicle. Hi right there. Don't worry about me. <laughs> I've been having a great time on the Pacific Theater, but man, this game is grindy. They really need to tweak the progression at least a little bit. Even with pretty high level gameplay, it still takes a long time to progress through some of these. And when the goal for several hours of progression is a shotgun I have no intention of using at all, I don't get any sort of real reward feeling for, <laughs> for that grinding. By the way, I talk about where I've been the last few months over on one of these longer videos. In short, since I don't do all of this full time, I haven't had the time I would like to be able to do editing. Consequently, I've been doing a lot of commentary playthroughs over on the Long Place channel. At this point, I'm uploading over to the Long Plays channel at least three times a week, so be sure to check that out if you're ever just curious what I've been up to. Thanks for watching.